our limestone mines at Alathur are one of the most technologically advanced and least polluting cement mines in India. By using non-traditional mining technologies like surface miners, we were able to completely eliminate drilling and blasting operations which allows us to be both eco-friendly and cost-effective. This is a very eco-friendly mining we are adopting here and the deposit is very much conducive here that means this is very soft and uh, hence we are deploying surface miners. Plantation we are carrying out in a exclusively in a very good manner with one horticulturist separately engaged for the purpose and uh, we have got so many awards from the government even uh, Mr. Piyush Goyal for the National Environmental Excellence Award for this limestone mining operation. Limestone extracted from mines is transported through dippers and dumpers to this dump hopper for crushing. In this dump hopper, we have water spray system for dust-free atmosphere. In this crushing section, we have three types of crushers, namely primary crusher, secondary crusher and tertiary crusher. In this crushing section, we have reduced the size of limestone from maximum of one cubic meter to 50 mm size. We are at the flotation plant. It is one of the innovative and most advanced flotation plant for limestone application. In this flotation plant, we recover the lime by processing the slurry from benefication plant. The slurry from benefication plant fed into the conditioner and flotation tank for processing. In this process, froth is generated. The generated froth is stored in concentrate thickener. Remaining is stored in tailing thickener. The stored material from thickener fed into the horizontal belt filters. This is one of the largest belt filter erected in Asia. In this belt filters, the water is separated from slurry and material is used for our process. The crushed limestone from the crusher is transported to a storage shed through enclosed long belt conveyors with a span of more than 1,800 meters in an environment-friendly manner. Limestone passing through the conveyor undergoes meticulous quality check using cross belt analyzer and gamma matrix lab interview. The limestone storage shed prevents the limestone from the moisture and rain and also ensure clean environment. At our Alathur plant, we have two storage sheds with the capacity of 28,000 tons each. The stacker reclaimer system at the shed creates a homogenized limestone mixture, avoiding segregation and ensures even more distribution of finer and coarse particles across the pile. Homogenized limestone from the LSS and additives from additive storage shed are fed into raw mill hoppers. The limestone and the additives are weighed in the weigh feeder to a required proportion before grinding in the vertical roller mill. German-made Loesch vertical roller mill is used for grinding the raw material. In a vertical roller mill, the materials are ground into finer particles and moisture is evaporated by the hot gases from the preheater. A major portion of the finished raw meal is removed from the gas stream into the cyclones, while the remaining fine particles are collected in raw mill bag house. The fine powdered raw material mixture from vertical roller mill, also known as raw meal, is stored in the continuous flow silo. Regarding the quality control activities at Alatiyo, we have the cross belt analyzer for analyzing limestone supplied by the mines, in which the entire quantity of the limestone being analyzed by the gamma rays and other raw materials, in process materials and final products are analyzed in our XRF to achieve the set quality of quality parameters of the products. Ground raw material is fed into five-stage preheater cyclones with inline precalciner. Hot gases from the kiln preheats the material before the calcination stage. This helps to save energy. Kiln is a huge rotating furnace fueled with pet coke and imported coal. For firing the fuel, we are using the burners where finely ground coal is fired into the kiln. In Co Alathur plant, we have two kilns with a capacity of 3,700 TPD each with high velocity. A computerized central control room, CCR, 
enables the monitoring, visualization and control of all equipment on the production line. From the central control room, the operators get alerted on process deviations of the production lines. The remote management enables through Ramco's proprietary software, provides fast and safe control and supervision of the process by offering an overall comprehensive and detailed display. At Ramco Alathur plant, we have two kilns with a capacity of 3,700 TPD each. Kiln heats the raw meal up to 1,450 degrees Celsius. This temperature allows to release carbon dioxide gas from the raw meal and many chemical reactions takes place then converts it into clinker which is a semi-finished product. This process is called clinkerization. The resulting clinker is rapidly cooled from 1450 degrees Celsius to 120 degrees Celsius using a cooling system where we are having five forced trot fans and one vent fan in order to cool the clinker. The cooled clinker is then transferred and stored in clinker silos. We have totally four numbers of electronic packer in our packing plant to pack the cements. Our electronic packers are highly precise. Different types of cement extracted from the compartment silo to packers through elevators, vibrating screen and packer bins. Once the empty bags are inserted to the packer, automatically it will fill. Once it is reached 50 kg weight, then only it will discharge to the belt conveyors. The loaded cement bags are coming to the belt conveyor, loading into truck loading machine through trucks. We have the facility of wagon loading machine also. We have the facility of load the cement bags by bulk loading also. The different types of bags are laminated bags, HTPC bags, paper bags and POP bags. At Ramco Alatur, we have installed a 42 megawatt thermal coal based captive power plant to cater to the needs of our manufacturing plant. Our mines, cement plant, and our workers' colony are completely powered by this thermal power plant, and the fly ash generated from the plant is captively consumed in the manufacture of Portland Pozolona cement. We have a beautiful TRCL colony which spreads around 63 acres. We have all the facilities inside the colony. We have stores, we have hospital, we have gym, library, beautiful uh, gardens. Everything is inside the colony and our employees can utilize this. We have uh, planted around 50,000 trees inside the colony and the temperature inside the colony is uh, 2 degrees less than what uh, the temperature will be outside. The Ramco Cements Alatiu has a structured CSR program. We have a local CSR committee who guides us in conceptualizing and implementing the program. We at Ramco believe that our growth in business lies with the growth of our neighboring community. In that sense, we involve our community from the inception of the project, during implementation and as well as for the sustenance of the program. That is the main success for our CSR effort. And we have been supporting uh, the community with individual smart toilets, community toilets, wherever uh, the toilets are required to address the open defecation. Under quality education, we have been supporting the government schools with functioning toilet, good infrastructure facility, and supporting additional teachers in schools where the student's teacher ratio is higher and where, is, where there is absence of teachers. And we have been providing educational materials uh, books, notebooks, school bags, uniforms to the children. Under environment, agri and livelihood promotion, we have been uh, doing the desiltation of ponds in nearby uh, villages and we have been supplying water from our mines area to the uh, ponds 
and we have we have been planting uh, saplings in the villages as well as in our mines area to increase the green cover in this location.